Yo, 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 it's D. Arthur in the building. <laughs> Talking to you guys today about the art of not caring about females when you go on semen retention. You will not, when you decide to not really care about women on semen retention, that is when you attract, that's, that's when you start attracting all of them because, because subconsciously, Women tend to go after the man who doesn't seem to care about her as much. Subconsciously, it displays higher value. It displays higher status than her. Think about it. Think about it. If someone... If someone... If you thought you were, quote unquote, better than someone... If you thought you were better than someone and you gave them no attention whatsoever because you really just didn't care and they were attracted to you, wouldn't that make them... Wouldn't that make them more attracted to you to try to try to chase or try to do something to attract you? That That's kind of the case. That's what I'm trying to get at. You have to focus on yourself. Guys give so much power to women. They they say she's my everything. They, 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 just do, they just put so much dependency on her, so much pressure on her. This is why they this is why they lose. This is why they lose. Usually, if I'm asking a girl out, I say, let's go here, here, and here, but no pressure, though. There has to be a... You guys put too much dependency on her. She she can't she can't put so much pressure on her making these decisions. This is, this is how you lose. Neediness is the one, number one attraction repellent. If you're needy for a girl, she'll never... She'll never really genuinely like you. And I've seen this firsthand. Neediness kills all attraction. Non-neediness, nonchalant, laid back attitude, focusing more on other things, different perspective, perspectives. This is what's attract more attractive because it just shows that you're a higher value man. You're not so focused on just one girl who's saying no. You're, you're focused on yourself. You're focused on improving your life. And this is how this is genuinely what is attractive. So when you when you tend to ignore them or focus on yourself, really focus on yourself. This is when you start attracting them at all. Now, see more attention is not about woman attraction, but this is the byproduct of what happens when you go on retention. You are going to become a, a higher value, more present energy man. <laughs> And she subconsciously will see this and will be attracted to you. It's, it really gets, it, you have to treat, treat women like a shadow. If you walk, the shadow will follow. If you try to see where the shadow is at, it will not appear. This is how you have to start looking at your life. You have to focus on other things. You have to, you have to be, you have to focus on other things that give you joy. It, the woman cannot be the only sole focus <laughs> that gives you joy because usually women aren't even concerned about men. This this is the best, the biggest misconception that the man thinks that that the man thinks that the woman is stuck on the man. Usually, this usually is this not not even the case. It's usually more the man is stuck on the woman because men tend to just. Some men just tend to focus on things are just so 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 whipped on on a said person that they can't live with themselves. Usually, if in terms of a breakup or something like that, women move a lot. Move, women move a lot quicker than men. Move they move on a lot quicker. This is how you have to be. You have to focus on yourself. You have to improve on yourself. You have to. You have to really enjoy, start gen genuinely enjoying yourself, enjoying yourself, enjoying your life, really doing the things that you like, putting putting yourself in in environments that may be that you that you can be in where you see eye to eye with the people around there. This is a big key, and just focus on becoming the best version of yourself. Someone somehow will be attracted to this version of you and they'll they'll come around 
the worst thing to do is be stuck on one person and just not be present. It is the worst thing you can be is not be a present human being. Always, always focused on what she's doing, but never really focused on yourself. You will become a magnet on retention. <laughs> you will be, especially if you're in social settings and you're gone and you go on retention and you're just attractive and you are just going about your business like it is, you're going to be a lot more attractive. This is the key. This is how you have to get yourself up to focus on yourself. I cannot say this. I cannot repeat this enough. Focus on being your best version. Focus on being the most well-rounded version. And I mean everything. I mean every single aspect of your life. I mean, I mean financially, mentally, spiritually, physically, charismatically, emotionally. All these things are well-rounded in your life. Put yourself in positions that you agree with. And just live your life. Someone, somehow, who is attracted to you will, will come. They will, they can't help but come. Because this is the aura you're giving off. This is pretty much it as it is. So there's no no need to complain. Gu guys are always talking about what she's doing. They never focus on themselves. This is why they're always lacking. But somehow she's 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 pretty much is focused on herself. And this is why she wins and you lose. Because she's focused on herself. She's focused on herself, and you're focused on her. And this is a big no. This is a big problem. You have to focus on yourself. You have to do the things that you like to do. You have to self-improve. Now, self-improvement is not going to keep anybody around, but self-improvement will attract people into your life because they see what you're displaying off. This is how it, this is how as this is how easy as it gets. So when you go decide to go on retention, you start ignore just focus on yourself, ignoring other things, other people being focus on the best version of you you will start attracting people and then it's up to you to pick who you are most attracted based off the, the the options that you're given and then go from there but if you're chasing something and it's not reciprocating any energy back you're going to sooner or later you're going you're going to lose you're, sooner or later you're going to lose the worst thing you can do is chase her Especially when she's not reciprocating any energy back. You got to be more serious about your life. There has to be things that you do that other people wish they did, but they don't do. Consistency is what separates the average from the elite. Being consistent. You got to be consistent in everything. Spiritually, mentally, physically. You have to be consistent. Consistency is what separates you from the pack, be consistent, be happy, focus on yourself, be in environments that you agree with, and then the people in those environments who see this attraction will, will subconsciously come near you, and then, then you can go from there. This is how you should look at it. This is how you should look at it. So... Like I said, guys are way too focused on her. Focus on you. There, there's so many people talking about she she did this to me. She did this. She left me. And I I, I understand how how painful it may be, get, but you have to realize that you have to be the main character in your life. You got to be the main character. You got to improve tenfold. You got to use that hurt and dissatisfaction to improve your life and make the hurt feel good that's this is why guys go to guys usually maybe if they're going through a breakup or something they tend to go to the gym a little bit extra harder so they can they can just become a better version of themselves so that heartbreak that they had they can transmute it into legit results and they can have a better life because of it there are no L's ever. There's just lessons. There's no L's. There's just lessons. So just learn from your mistakes or learn from the past and then improve. And this is pretty much what you can only do. She will be focused on you when you're not focused on her. I have seen this 10x. When I'm totally focused on me and myself and I, this is when I get the most attraction. But if I'm focused on her, seeing what she's doing, then there's no attraction. So use this advice and improve your life.
enough said. With that being said, like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.